They are so happy that everything is finally thawing and out. Buttercup bit me. Oh, Buttercup is a biter. Yep, he's a meanie head. But they got goodies this morning. This bucket was half full uh, from our neighbors. And then the green bowl is from our leftovers last night. So they're having some fun. And we ate Tim. We ate Tim a while ago. He was our other mean rooster. Yep. Yeah, he bit me right here. Yep, he bit you. And that made me so not happy. Just made me sad. I know, it was very sad when he bit you. But they are loving being able to go everywhere. There's a little bit of snow left in their their chicken yard, but but for the most part, everything's getting thawed. Shh, Claire, quiet. Yesterday, the kids and I came and we dug out we about eight inches of um, litter out of their coop. And there's still some in there, but we got super tired. We couldn't finish it all, but we brought it all out here and um, I spread it all around and I'm gonna let them compost that for me. Happy girls. You can hear in here, we've got a couple that are laying. Oh, I guess one of them finished. Oh, there's one little laying girl. And oh, we got two eggies already. Hi. Yep, I'm gonna come get the eggs. Okay, Growly, we hear you. We hear you. Thank you, girls. Keep on working, you're doing a good job. How we get our eggs. This loud one over here is growly. She's the only one who does that. <laughs> I know we hear you. It's a beautiful morning. You can hear all the birds and the sun is shining. And we just saw some sandhill cranes come flying. You hear them first. They sound, um, they have like a, a very distinct sound. And I looked up and there they were. Last year we sat out here and we watched probably hundreds migrating. Just flock after flock after flock after flock. It was really cool. It was about this time of year. Kate Growly, we hear you. I know. They all used to have some names, but now they all just look exactly the same. So <laughs> we don't have names for any of them except for Growly because she's the only one who growls. <laughs> but I decided that... So I was going to, so this is a whole area is fenced off, right, for them. Um, and I was going to divide it up. I still am, but I'm not going to do it this year like I had planned. So I was going to do a fence here and then a fence here. So there would be one, two paddocks and then a fence here for three paddocks. And then over here, there would be a fourth paddock and then right here would be their run where we put all their compost and stuff like it is now. Um, and they would have access to this in the coop all day long, but then from each there'd be little gates, you know? And so then I'd alternate them. They would have this plus this for a week, then that for a week and then that for a week and that for a week. And that way, um, it gives each area that they're in time to, regrow, repopulate with bugs, all of that. Um, and so every little paddock that they went into, they'd fertilize, they'd prune it, all of the things, um, without completely destroying it. Uh, cause that's what chickens do best. They are very good tillers and they like to dig. 
and um, as you can see, watch them, see, <laughs> they like to dig. And so, uh, so I was gonna do that this year, but I've decided that, you know what, I'm not gonna do it because this is all still grass over here. They really need some more time to work on all this and till it up before I can even plant seed because I wanna plant seed down and um, do like a cover crop of foods that they eat, grains and, um, you know, just things like that, clover, whatever. And uh, they've done a pretty good job so far over here. So you can see that's all dirt. This is mostly all dirt over here. They've really dug this up and tilled it really nicely. There's still a lot of grass, but, um, you know, like, look at them. They're really getting that grass up and digging it down. So that's what I want them to do with the entire area. They've done it like all the way back to about here. But right here, they haven't really done anything with. So I'm gonna give it another year. I'm gonna let them do their fertilizing and their digging and tilling and um, hopefully this will all be dirt. And then next fall, I'll come out here and plant seed and maybe get some fencing put up and all that first and then plant seed. And uh, let it germinate over the winter and have pastures for them to roam in next year. So, look at them. They're so happy. They're in the sun. It's so wonderful. I know, Growly. I hear you. She's so noisy. Buttercup, I know. You're here to protect. I know, Growly. <laughs> They're really finding some goodies. Some goodies right there. Digging deep in there. <laughs> anyway, chicken cam. Oops, are you gonna, you're, oh, you're gonna get my shoe. Oh, he's such a mean little guy. We're going out of town for the week. My neighbors are chicken sitting and he's gonna have his own little pen in the garage so they don't have to worry about rooster attacks. <laughs> Rally, we hear you. Anyway, it's so peaceful. All right, long enough. Goodbye.